Good morning, everyone. It's Edward with Twitty and Company, just giving you an update on our current situation this morning. First of all, uh, Dare and Curry Tuck counties are both still restricted this morning. So if you're a visitor and, and you're thinking the storm has passed, I'm going to come on down. Please wait until you get firm word that that ban on travel has been lifted. We're still under a state of emergency. We're still um, in that situation. So if you're if you're a guest trying to come on down, they're going to turn you around the bridge. So as soon as we know any change of that, we'll let you know. But we have no control over that, and and we have no knowledge of when that decision will change. Uh, about all we know is when they meet. So as soon as we get word, which will be when the decision is made, we'll we'll put it out there for you. That being said, we are we have been able to open our offices. I'm standing in front of the Corral office right now. We've got some staff inside, uh, and they've actually been held up in Corral since before the storm, and most of them haven't been able to get home. But they're here at work this morning, and, and we really appreciate it. We've got our folks that were able to make it to Duck this morning, and uh, you know you may. I'm acting kind of like it's a, a big accomplishment because it is. You know, most of our staff still does not have power. Some folks have damage to their homes and you know we're trying to get as much information to you as quickly as possible but it is uh, it was a it was a big accomplishment for us or we felt like it was just to get our offices staffed enough to open this morning and we're trying to get that information out there to you as quickly as possible. So that being said Again, no access for visitors into the area. Our offices are open. We can take calls and questions. Please just have some patience with us though because we are understaffed and uh, we're getting out into the communities as much as possible to assess damage and, and accessibility, habitability of homes. So we'll keep you updated. If anything changes of that, uh, in that nature, I'll let you know. And, and uh, we're, uh, we're in that post-storm mode just trying to assess what's going on and, and we'll keep you informed as well as we can. So I hope everyone stayed safe out there and made it through the storm all right. And we look forward to the time when we can see you again.